Hey there YouTube! This weekend I pretty much just sat at home in the humidity and read Harry Potter fanfiction. Part of this was because I was feeling a bit under the weather, but mostly lazy. My weekend paled in comparison to the various friends I had who were at conventions across the United States this weekend. So I was super super jealous about that. Oh, VidCon! Since I started living in Japan, I get told a lot, Oh my god, you're so lucky you're living in Japan, everything must be awesome for you all the time. This tends to happen a lot when I'm either bored or having a bad day or just generally unhappy about something. Like, automatically the fact that I live in Japan at the moment just means that nothing bad can happen at all. But you know, not everything is sunshine and rainbows. Of course I try to live every day awesomely, but I mean, I live here, so I have to do things like go to school and homework and pay rent and bills. I'm here to study and experience a different kind of lifestyle. I'm not here for a vacation. Okay, maybe I'm here for a little bit of a vacation. Sometimes when I'm having a bad day, I feel bad about having a bad day and that just makes it worse because I know that there are people out there who are ex extremely jealous of the place I live right now and that they want to be in my shoes and that I'm really lucky to be here. Believe me, I understand these feelings. Look at celebrities I like and particularly the people I'm subscribed to on YouTube and I think, wow, I want to be them. Their life looks so cool. Everything must be awesome for them. But those people are living their lives just like I'm living my life. They have bad days where bad things happen to them and they do mundane things like pay bills and sit in traffic. What I'm getting at here is that no matter where people are or what they're doing, they're people just like me and you. Everyone has family drama and they have to do boring things and they have days where they feel crappy or they just sit around and read Harry Potter fanfiction all weekend. Look at people we admire or are doing things that we want to do, it's hard to think that bad things ever happen to them. Like that they've just been born in to this amazing situation where just everything is fabulous all the time. We forget that everyone is human, no matter where they live or how famous they are. I spend a lot of time on the internet and I see a lot of people talking about how boring their lives are and that this or that is stopping them from really doing what they want to do. But if you want something, go after it. You're not going to wake up one day and just suddenly be in this fantastic situation. You have to work for it. That's what I did. I wanted to go to Japan so I went to a school that had a strong Japanese study abroad program and ended up actually delaying my graduation from university so I could come here. I thought video blogging was cool and wanted to be like my favorite vloggers so I turned on my video camera and started talking to it. Nothing is stopping you from doing something interesting. Of course it's not going to be easy. You're going to hit some bumps on the road and it's going to take a lot of time. It took me like 10 years to get to Japan and I work every single day on my YouTube video so that someday I might actually be a good vlogger. Everyone who you think is cool started out just wishing they could do something. The reason that they're doing that cool thing now is because they went after it. They picked up a camera or got a job and started saving money or taught themselves a skill. They saw something they wanted to do and they went after it. Those amazing people you admire started out just like you and me. They had to work really hard to get to where they are now. So if you want to do something awesome, just get up and go and do it! That's all for today. Till next time. Bye-bye. I cut my fringe this weekend. It looks kind of weird. And apparently I call it fringe now.